In this video, I will discuss what does carnitine do? The main effect of carnitine is to increase the transport of fatty acids into the mitochondria. This has the net effect of increasing ATP levels. ATP is the intermediate unit of energy. It is the step between potential energy and kinetic energy. By raising ATP levels, carnitine has been found to increase immune function. This is because the immune system is one of the biggest consumers of energy. Carnitine also optimizes fat and carbohydrate metabolism. This means fats and carbohydrates are more efficiently utilized by the body, be it for energy generation or for biosynthesis. This produces side benefits such as lowering blood glucose and improving blood lipid profiles. This is very useful for the prevention and treatment of diabetes and for the prevention and treatment of cardiovascular diseases. An optimized carbohydrate metabolism also leads to improved glucose control, which means the elimination of mood swings. Most of the time, mood swings can be traced right back to oscillating blood sugar levels. And this is one of the reasons why carnitine has been found to have positive effects on mood. Improving blood lipid profiles simply means things like lowering LDL cholesterol this is the bad cholesterol, and raising HDL cholesterol, this is the good cholesterol. It also means decreased blood viscosity. This happens simply because you have less things floating around in your blood. And this allows the blood to flow better through your vascular system and deliver much needed oxygen and nutrients to your cells, as well as dispose of waste products. This effect has been found to lower blood pressure. Carnitine lowers blood pressure because the heart doesn't have to work so hard to push that thick blood through the arteries. When it comes to fatty acids, you should know that fatty acids can be oxidized while in the blood. These oxidized lipids actually damage blood vessels and cause atherosclerosis. By taking the fatty acids out of the blood and sending them into the mitochondria, carnitine not only increases energy production, but it also reduces atherosclerotic plaque formation. Because it is a shuttle molecule, Carnitine also takes waste products out of the mitochondria and into the blood, from which the waste can be excreted by the kidneys. This means cleaner, more efficient energy production. One side benefit of this is the elimination of age spots. Age spots are made up of accumulated lipofuscin, and carnitine helps clear out the lipofuscin. Carnitine has also been found to increase sperm mobility, and thus male fertility. This effect is likely due to increased energy production in the testicular tissues. In terms of antioxidant effects, carnitine increases glutathione and CoQ10 and scavenges the particularly damaging superoxide radical. Glutathione and CoQ10 are critical antioxidants. CoQ10 is also a critical energy nutrient. By increasing production of glutathione and CoQ10, carnitine reduces free radical damage and increases energy production. Carnitine has also been found to improve the flow of information between the right brain and the left brain. This effect is associated with increased intelligence. In this video you have learned what does carnitine do and a little bit about how it does it. Carnitine is a part of my essential nutritional supplement stack. If you want to see which are the products I personally use, then go to DamianAlexander.com slash carnitine. If you want to learn more about critical nutritional supplements, life extension, and disease prevention, then subscribe to my YouTube channel at Damien Alexander's Vids. Lastly, discover the easiest and shortest way to double physical and mental energy, strengthen immunity, and restore health by visiting howtochangeyourownbatteries.com.